everybody, I'm Ashley and Kaino from the My Best Self Project and welcome to your daily Tarascope forecast for Monday the 12th of March. So let's have a look at the cards to kick off the week. We have the Six of Air, which is pretty good. We have the Five of Fire, which is maybe not so good. <laughs> and the Eight of Air. Okay, we're good. I've got the message. I can see what's going on here, people. All right, so it looks like the general energy is things are getting better. There's been a difficult situation going on. Maybe you feel like you've been pulled in a couple of different directions. You have to make a decision. Uh, just really make um, a decision as a leader, if that makes sense. Like, okay, I'm making an executive decision for the greater good of all. That kind of thing. So let's break this down. We got the six of air. It says things are looking up. The end of a difficult situation, taking a trip. So this card is saying that things may have been challenging. I feel this could be in regards to work or this could be in regards to family life as well. Perhaps with children or your family, just really having to like take the reins as a leader. Maybe things have been a little bit challenging. And um, this is saying that things are going to settle down a little bit um, and it's going to get better. And perhaps you need to book a much needed getaway, some kind of trip for your family, for yourself to get a break from work, to get a break from the day to day family life, whatever it is. It's just saying that things are looking up, that um, the, the future is starting to look a bit brighter now. Um, but I do feel that with the five of fire, it says competing goals, bothersome details, conflicts with others. I feel like um, there are a lot of things you're trying to consider right now you're being pulled in multiple different directions so maybe you have your own goals of what you want to do and then there's like having to like be mom and having to um, be the wife and have to go to work or whatever it's like there's so many hats you have to wear that you're kind of being pulled in a lot of different directions and maybe feel like you're not progressing very far with any of these so I feel like what's going on here is you just really need to make uh, an executive decision and even just take control of the situation by simply sitting down with a piece of paper and writing out uh, what you need to do in order to fulfill all the hats that you wear so that you're making progress and make it like a to-do list and tick items off it so you can actually see that you're making progress. Like, okay, maybe you want to like make four videos today for your business or whatever creative project you're doing or anything like that. If you want to do it, uh, but you feel like, gosh, I'm never going to have the time to do that, just make the goal of doing one or writing one blog or whatever it is. Just do something, write it down and make progress so you can tick it off the list. That way you're like, okay, got the kids to school. Okay, got them to their sports. Uh, went to my job, did this project there. Oh, I did this for my side business. Went to the gym, whatever it is, make that list. And that way you're not gonna feel so overwhelmed. Like, oh, these goals are competing against themselves. Um, you're gonna feel more like, uh, things are falling into place and you're making progress. And so with eight of air, we have an illusion of being trapped, a lack of self-confidence, afraid to take action. And that's really where that last part that I just said comes in. I feel like what you really need to do is take that action, like make that list and check it off every day, write a to-do list, do it in order of priority, like what really needs to be done feed the kids, take them to school, go to work. Okay, that shit needs to be done. Then what else is like the top of your priority list? Hobby wise, maybe like I said, you're setting up a new business. So what's the thing that has to be done today? Put that at the top and work your way down the list. You're gonna really feel like you're making progress. So this is about taking action rather than being sort of frozen in fear and inaction because there's so much to do and feeling overwhelmed. Um, and even with imagery here, it's like there's an illusion of being trapped. So this horse is deciding to be the leader, take charge and charging forward. And all the others are still standing there kind of like afraid, like, Oh, don't do it. And this horse at the front is like, fuck it. I'm going to make it happen. I'm going for it. It doesn't need to be stressful. I just need to get organized and take control of the situation and go for it. So just say yes, believe in yourself, have confidence and go forward. Angel message of the day. Indigo, it says the person you're inquiring about is an indigo, meaning a highly sensitive natural born leader. I feel this is talking about you. Again, we got the imagery of the horse. Um, I feel leadership. And again, here it says a natural born leader. You're being called upon to step back into your leadership role that perhaps you've turned your back on a little bit because you got so overwhelmed with everything. You've maybe done like a 180 and you're like, I don't want to be the leader. I don't want to be the mom. I just want to be that uh responsibility list team that I used to be whatever it is back in the college days you know 
you're being called to get a grip, okay? You're being called to remember, like, this is where you're at in this point of time, and this is what you want to do with your future. So let's think about the now. What can you do? Let's get back into that leadership role, take control, and everything's going to be okay, all right? So it's saying just really make that decision. You won't feel so overwhelmed. You just have to like get all your ducks in a row, be organized, and take that action by checking off that to-do list. Really, really simple affirmation for the day. It says, instead of praying for an outcome, I pray for the highest good for all. And I feel like that's a really nice thing to say. So instead of kind of constantly thinking about like, I just want to get through life or I just want to achieve this one goal. How about actually like praying or putting out to the universe? You know, I just want everything to be good. I want everyone to be happy. I want, um, I want all these situations to be fulfilled. And therefore I do need to get organized. I need to see how I can rock this and that and this and all my different hats. So it's saying like, yeah, don't be just focusing on the outcome. Just really focus on what you need to do now to get through the day so that everything feels complete and like you've made progress and that you feel satisfied. And you're like, okay, this is good. Everything's working out good for the best here. So yes, like I said, things are looking up. It's the end of a difficult situation in regards to having so much stuff to do. Um, you may feel like you're being tugged in a thousand different directions, but it's just about really getting organized and taking that action, taking that, um, taking your leadership back in your life and just going for it. All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed today's Tarascope. Please like, share, tag your friend, or subscribe. And I look forward to bringing your Tarascope tomorrow. Bye.